Hello everyone, I hope you are having a wonderful day. Today I'm going to uh, share my little refinishing project. So do you remember this speaker? This is the CSS1 TDX Bookshare speaker, which is two-way design Bookshare speaker with soft tone tweeter and seven inch bass driver. And this one is superior uh, kit that I'm using. So previously when I did the uh, review and my building process of this uh, 1TDX bookshare speaker, what I did was the, uh, I did the uh, vinyl wrapping on this cabinet, which turns out okay, but not the best that I will appreciate in long term because at the time I, I don't have enough time to work on this kind of a veneering process and all that. So that was my quick work that I did. So I refinished this cabinet with this uh, teak wood veneer all around and I, I was able to gray match on the side so you, you can see the one flow from side to side all around the cabinet. I put all the veneer sheets on with contact cement and also, you know, I sand it down really nicely using different grids and end up using the 1000 grid at the end. And before I stain it, I, as usual, I clean it with their mineral spirits and everything. Processing of this refinishing is as usual. So if you want to know how I veneer these cabinets, please check on that 2DDX, uh, you know, the video number two, so which I show them in detail. So this one, I finish it and, I, you know, I cut everything out with the uh, edge trimming bit and everything turns out pretty nice. But uh, I don't want to have the same color as yeah, my 2DDX tower, so I end up staining this cabinet. I like to have a antique uh, rustic look yet has yeah, a little bit vivid color so this one I mix uh, two different color so that's how it turns out and then uh, also I use the uh, polyurethane coating this time I use semi gloss on this also did the uh, upgrading on your binding post the reason is I'm not really big fan of those uh, you know, metal binding posts that they come with it because the knob and everything is metal. In the long run, they change color. And also another thing that I don't like about is the yeah, two binding posts are too close together. I want to upgrade on this cabinet, which is the binding post. And also I want to mount them on this, my Bowers and Wilkins 24 inch stand with the, uh, I want to bolt it down basically. So when I finish staining these cabinets, five layers of uh, semi-gloss polyurethane coating and you know, sanding between the coats, so it takes a while. But uh, it turns out pretty decent and I'm pretty happy because there is no unevenness or noticeable uneven coating area, especially on polyurethane coating. But the actual color stain, I'm not really happy about it because some area I have could have done better, but it's pretty decent and pretty nice. This CSS1 TDX is a very easy to work on for the kit wise and the sound quality, you know, probably one of the best. Probably you're not going to find anything better under $2,000 range. So this is gonna be my main reference two-way speakers in this price point because I really like the way it sounds. I really like the way it responds to pairing components. Since, you know, when I review different decks, this one totally shows you yeah, different in sound, different in, you know, sound reproductions out of those digital to analog converter. This one is, almost transparent yet it has a nice tonality and really in enjoyable musical experience that you may enjoy listening to very long time so i'm very happy the way it's turned out and the look wise this one you know i kind of like this kind of color and natural colors because i like the way they respond to the light because I have big windows on this side and big windows on this side. You know, when I open the curtains, then they will totally reveal their true color. And even at night, they are not muted yet. It still shows yeah, the 
vibrant color, naturally vibrant color itself. So that's why I prefer this kind of color finishing. But uh, I could do a little bit better uh, finishing on staining. So probably that's going to be on next project. So this one, I'm pretty happy the way it turned out. I'm very, I'm already happy with the way they sound with my components, the way they sound in my system. So my advice is if you're going to buy any speakers around $2,000 range or even $2,500 range, you should try this. I mean, that performance and sound quality is as good as those in up to like two to $2,500 price range, if not better. And doesn't matter two ways or three way bookshelf speakers, doesn't matter. You can, these will destroy many of them in terms of uh, bass quality and mid-range accuracy and dynamic range and attack with the really nice attack and impact that you know, kick drum wax are probably one of the best that I ever heard out of bookshelf speakers in any price range. That is a true experience. You know, if you are thinking about getting like Pucat Audio S300 or S400, give these guys a try. These guys, probably these guys will smoke them in terms of sound quality and price, performance, and everything combined. Plus, you are getting something from American company for those of you, those of you here in the United States. So truly, you know, appreciate the way that they come out with this one TDX or two TDX towers. So overall, I'm very happy with the way it turns out. This finishing, not as good as I would like to be, especially the staining the color, but pretty close, probably like 70% close to the way I imagined, but I will be, probably I can do better job next time around. So this is how it turns out and I'm decently happy with the way it look and the, I'm very happy with the way they sound. So this is gonna be my new reference for two-way bookshelf speaker up to two to $3,000 price point. So that is my quick update, my friend. Thank you for watching and happy listening. Come into my solitude, though I weary be. Come into my tenderness, dream along with me. Listen to the whisper sing, listen to the singer shout. Come into my solitude, meet my big mouth. And say, lies of heart and home, children broken on the bed and left to lie alone. Things you talk around, scum the joke on down. Come into my solitude, step on sacred ground. We were speaking of values and Wonderland, the rooms that will not 
Steps that do not sound Come into my soul 